Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Please subscribe and like the channel to stay up to date with the latest celebrity news. We always update the hottest news posted daily. Latest news for today Sunday, December 19th, 2021. We invite you to update the news. An anonymous spectator caused controversy and received the most reaction from the audience when they wrote, the only person who can fix Dammy is Dammy, and she's not going to do it until she actually wants to, which currently she clearly does not. Which is actually pretty understandable, if you look at it a certain way. Reasons for Tammy to keep on as she is, 1. Food is her primary source of comfort, pleasure, excitement, and interest in her daily life. It probably also provides a good deal of her structure, her life isn't lived day to day, but meal to meal. 2. As long as she's hypermorbidly obese, nobody expects anything of her and she's free to continue sitting around idle, eating and doing whatever else she wants. She doesn't have to work, she doesn't have to take care of herself, her home, or anyone else, she doesn't even have to grow up. I'm sure it's a comfortable spot to be in, at least in some ways. 3. Her way of life and her condition have brought her a degree of success and fame, or at least notoriety, with some positive attention along with all the negative. If she were to change, there would no longer be anything special or noteworthy about her. To clarify, Making a change like the one she'd have to make would be a pretty staggering achievement, and worthy of notice in itself. But trying to look at it from her current perspective, I doubt she can imagine the life she might be able to create based on that change. Reasons for Tammy to actively avoid changing her life 1. Tammy has the intellectual maturity of a preteen. In my totally non professional estimation, she's mature enough to be sullen, moody, and horny but not mature enough to delay gratification or consider her own long-term well-being. She lacks the cognitive and psychological capacity to undertake the rigors of real change in her life. 2. Change would require her to permanently turn her back on everything that currently brings her happiness and pleasure, with no promise of equivalent rewards on the other side. 3. The process of changing would suck. It would be stressful, painful and exhausting. A body that size is an exquisitely uncomfortable place to be. Obesity encourages people to disconnect from their bodies to avoid feeling that pain. She would have to actively get back into her body and feel all the pain that it brings. It would get a lot worse before it ever began to get better. 4. And even when she's done, there are a few obvious rewards. Her body will still be all fucked up, even with a lot of physical therapy and rehab. Vast amounts of loose skin, joint damage, the very real possibility of ongoing health problems despite weight loss, very likely numerous surgeries to correct lingering issues if she could even afford them. 5. She'd be joining the world of functional adults at a huge disadvantage, little education, no life or work skills, stunted social skills, and the baggage of her YouTube career still following her. She would be unlikely to ever find work at a comfortable wage, and maybe not even a livable one. The jobs available to her would most likely be tedious, menial ones. And at the end of even the most successful arc, what waits for her? More years of the same? The only thing that might counter the temptation to just stay where she is would be the visceral reality of a long, humiliating decline followed by a slow, painful death. But by the time that becomes a reality she could wrap her head around, it would probably already be too late to avoid it. Dammy's not going to make it, she'll die young, and while it will be a tragedy, the few people who genuinely love her will probably also find it a relief and a mercy. Which might be the saddest part of all? 